For the CircuitPython Parsec today, I wanted to show you how you can use the pressed and released states inside of the keypad library. So there is a built-in library in CircuitPython called Keypad, and it's useful for all kinds of button uses, in this case a fairly literal keypad. And you can see here in my code, I've imported Keypad, and then I'm doing some display stuff here and some NeoPixel stuff. I set up the Keypad object named Keys, and it uses these 12 board pins to be the keys that are inside of that object. So in the main loop here, in while true, we have an object called event, which is based on keys, events, gets. So this goes and gets all of the keys that have some sort of state change going on with them. If there is any event of any kind, this could be that something has been pressed, that something is being held, that something has been released, then we're gonna run some checks. Now the simplest version of this, and you'll see this in the most basic examples, is I'm going to set the text on the screen uh, and change a pixel color and show that pixel color. So this is when I press something. So I've pressed the first key, we get a zero on the screen and we change that LED to red. Now you can see, as I'm pressing each of these, it sets that state, but it doesn't really know about me releasing it. It's just kind of waiting around for that to be pressed. So this slightly more sophisticated version you can do, if you look at my code here, I'm gonna uncomment this bottom section. Here you can see I'm actually drilling down a little further and I'm saying if the event is that it was pressed, then we're gonna list the key number and we're gonna set the color to red. But if that key gets released, we're going to change the text to a couple of underscores and we're gonna set the color to blue. So if I resave that code there, you can see now when I press, we get one thing. When I release, we get another. And so this is just a little bit more sophisticated, a little bit more useful in a lot of cases to know not just that something got pressed, but that it also got released. And so that is how you can use keypad with the pressed and released states inside of CircuitPython. And that's your CircuitPython Parsec.